police say that when the dad left for work, that was the last time he heard from his daughter when she texted him saying that somebody was knocking on the door. And what they say, they, they said that there was no signs of forced entry. Families and police are trying to figure out who killed 11-year-old Maria Gonzalez at the small apartment complex on Main Street in Pasadena. Police say she was sexually assaulted. Carmelo Gonzalez is Maria's dad. Gonzalez told us Maria texted him after he left for work Saturday morning. She said someone was knocking on the door. Family members then went to check on her, but they didn't see or hear anything. Gonzalez finished his shift at work, and when he got home five hours later after that initial text, he says he found her dead, hidden under a bed. The father's alibi checks out. Police say at this time his alibi checks out and that he is not a suspect. Police told us federal investigators are helping to figure out what happened to Maria. DNA samples have been taken from people who live in the complex. But police said they're running into some roadblocks. Getting cooperation has been has been you know, frankly, somewhat of a challenge. My mom is in Guatemala. Gonzalez told us Maria's mom was in Guatemala when this happened. He says he doesn't understand how someone could do something this awful. No voy a descansar hasta. He told us he is not going to rest until he figures out exactly what happened. We don't know if they're operational. There were security cameras, but police say it's unclear if they were working at the time. Reporting in Pasadena, Giovanni Ligi, ABC 13 Eyewitness News. We also want to keep Maria's photo up for a moment here. Pasadena police chief says he has a child around her age and he's very concerned there are no arrests. As for those cameras at the complex, police say they may have been damaged in the storm a few months ago, but he says detectives are going through a mountain of digital evidence.